Dwarven Miner is an uncommon from 1996's Mirage. Rutabaga is an inherently funny word. Just is. Dwarven Miner saw some minor sideboard play back during Mirage Tempest Era Standard. It's a handy way to disrupt some mana bases, but aside from that and the funny flavor text, honestly, probably Dwarven Miner's most notable feature is the weird crossroads in history where we almost sort of not really ish got it in modern. Eighth edition was wild because it was being worked on in an era where like, boy, that internet's pretty neat, huh? You can get a lot of engagement with that internet. So for eighth edition, the magic website just let us vote between cards to be included in the set. Uh, there is some wild stuff in there, especially with the modern knowledge that eighth edition is the cutoff point for what counts as modern legal. Uh, in another timeline, maybe we're playing Yockel Hops and Static Orb in Modern. But Dwarven Miner, back to that. Dwarven Miner was the option against Blood Moon. Dwarven Miner was never going to win against Blood Moon, but what if it did, you know? Like, does Blood Moon get reprinted in 9th? Do we ever get Blood Sun or Winter Moon? What's the temporal cascade of events here, huh? Anyway, the numbers on those polls are kind of funny to look at now, especially knowing how much magic has grown since 2002. Fetch the Pest Raider, Paka! We got dwarves in the Rutabagers! <laughs>